How many atmosphere and the experience? Oh, it was awesome. I mean, first game since playing in the Elite Eight, I've had a ball. Um, you know, I started out like any other rookie, I ain't gonna lie. I had a lot of butterflies, I was very nervous, legs felt heavy. You know, it's your first game out in front of everyone and you're just trying to uh, change the tide of organization, especially being the number one pick. And we did, a, we did a great job tonight as a team, taking that first step of changing the view of this team and making us a winning team. How do you think about the atmosphere for a summer league game that was almost like a Kentucky game? I know. Um, I actually, it's amazing to think uh, how awesome the summer league, the NBA really is. I mean, uh, not many people get a chance to play in this, and I've been blessed to take my first step today. Uh, felt everything went okay. I thought uh, definitely got my feet wet. I got more comfortable as the game went along, got more confident, started throwing some flashier passes and uh, started doing a little more things. Uh, but I'm very happy. I mean, the last time I played here, I played Team USA as a freshman. You remember that. I've heard you play with some of your teammates. Some of the guys that are on this team now are guys you'll play with next year. Zach, Adrian, what was it like to Get out and run with those guys. Uh, I think as you can see on the court, uh, for a team that just met along and we're very young, we have a lot of chemistry. We're seeing each other at times when people, other people wouldn't. Uh, Tyus is a great addition to it. I mean, you have to also put him in there. Uh, the passing and everything is really working for us. We're doing a great job of getting each other the ball. I mean, as you can see on the scoring sheet, even distribution of points. Uh, that just shows a sign of, of non-selfish basketball and everyone getting a chance to shoot. What's the biggest thing you learned tonight? I think the biggest thing I learned tonight was, <laughs> if I'm right, how to play 32 minutes. Uh, I'm used to a platoon system. It's 19 minutes, 20 minutes, you're playing five minute spurts. I was playing uh, 10, 11 minutes straight. So uh, it's different, obviously, I'm not going to lie. Uh, but the platoon definitely saved my legs, definitely for the league. And I, I'm more than glad we did that system. I also learned today more about using your body. Uh, I use my body a lot in college, but today you got to use your body a little more. People are more crafty in the NBA other than just banging and seeing who is stronger. Uh, it's more crafty game. Uh, as I got more and more used to it, I was able to go back to the right hand hook and make some things happen. But uh, all in all, I think today was a great day. Leading up to this game was one versus two. How did you put that aside and just realize it was Timberwolves versus Lakers? <laughs> I mean, look at the look at your front of your jersey. It doesn't matter what the back says. It matters what the front says. And we went out there as a team, and we wanted to come out with a W. We all contributed in great ways today, and uh, we came out with a W. And uh, for a lot of people, they don't see a lot of Ws from uh, Minnesota Timberwolves, but today this is the W you can see, and it's a start, and it's a great start. Uh, I think after I shot the air ball three, yeah, the jitters went away. I, you know what? I didn't even want to shoot the basketball. It's just rookie jitters. I mean, everyone, uh, I'm not going to be perfect. Just because I'm number one pick doesn't mean I'm going to be perfect going out. Uh, I just went out there, and I just tried to play my best for my team and give them the best chance. Uh, we saw a lot of double teaming today, so I just wanted to make sure everyone got the ball and uh, just try to contribute as much as possible.